Hey everyone, if you're tired of entering your password every time you start or wake up your computer, this video is for you. Today, I'll show you how to turn off the login password and also disable lock screen in Windows 11. Let's get started. First, we'll remove the need to enter a password when you turn on your computer. From the taskbar, right click on the Windows icon and select run. In the run box, let's type NET PLWIZ and hit enter. A window called user accounts will pop up. Now uncheck the box that says user must enter a username and password to use this computer and click on apply. It will ask you to enter a password one last time. Type your current password, confirm it, then click on ok. And that's it, you won't be asked for a password the next time you start your computer. Next, let's stop Windows from asking for a password when you wake up from sleep. Right click on the start button and select settings. On the left, select accounts, then click on sign in options. And under the sections that says if you have been away, when should Windows require you to sign in again? Change it to never. and make sure for improved security is turned off. Now, if you want to remove the lock screen entirely when booting up, here is an optional step. From the Windows search, let's type gpedit.msc and open the group policy editor. Now, if you're using Windows Home Edition, you won't find the group policy editor by default. Therefore, you need to enable it. I left a video on how to do that down in the video's descriptions. Once in the group policy editor, let's go to computer configurations, administrative templates, control panel, personalization. And we need to double click on the do not display lock screen and make sure to enable it. And that's it. You've successfully disabled the login password and lock screen in Windows 11. If this helped, drop a like and consider subscribing for more tech tips like this. Thank you for watching.